Hello YouTubers, Hardik Patel here and I am back with this DIY fix video for this Ryder AM Zion Gimbal. I have this uh, Ryder AM Zion Gimbal since a few months now and recently I started having the issue that uh, whenever I turn it on and when I start recording sometimes it jitters and vibrates and um, makes like a uh, sudden shake. Uh, while it's recording while it's moving left to right or right to left or up or down so it was like kind of annoying business and I was like frustrated with this so I just wanted to fix it and I tried to search on YouTube many people are there but couldn't find the right solution so I just uh, thought let's go on my way and see what happens so if you are facing the same issue with Rider M what you can do is just update the firmware to the latest firmware and to do that I will show you how to do step by step if you know just cut this video and you can do by your own but people who don't know how to download and go step by step to update firmware or upgrade firmware let's get started before you start anything just make sure you connect the gimbal to the computer so let me turn the gimbal off first once it's off just connect it with the help of the USB provided by the Zion. Once you connect that, make sure it's attached the USB to the laptop or computer. And then you have to download few things. So go to zion-tech.com or if you can just go to Google and then type Zion Tech, then you will find the first option, zion-tech.com. On the zion-tech.com, you can go to, under the download, go to firmware, Under the firmware, just go down, scroll down and select Rider M. Once you select the Rider M, here we'll have few options. If you are having the Mac, then you can download the Zion USB driver from Mac OS uh, download button. Or if you are having the Windows, then select more above Windows 7 download button. Just click on that and download calibration upgrade tools and firmware once you do that once you download all these uh, zip files just right click and extract all those zip files using the windows rar I have Windows RAW already installed so I can use it. Once you do that, just click the CP210 VCP installer x64. Once you install that, run and everything is installed. Then click on Zion Gimbal Tool, double click on it. It will open the Zion Gimbal Tools make sure you turn the gimbal on once you turn it on go to zion gimbal tools click on open once you click open your product will be find out and recognized on under the product section rider m go to settings click default settings and save then go to firmware upgrade and browse the firmware under the path and select this Rider M firmware V1.51 PTZ. Click on that and open it. Once you do that, just click upgrade. Once you click upgrade, it will say update complete using blah 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 seconds. Please turn on the gimbal to run new firmware. So what you can do simply is just Turn the gimbal off and then turn it on. Once it's on, just click on close under the Zion gimbal tools. Close it, close everything, disconnect the gimbal. Once you disconnect, your gimbal should be ready. If still problem persists, then what you can do is just contact your supplier or distributor and 
tell them about the issue and they're supposed to fix it if it's under warranty. So I hope this way you can fix the Rider M vibration or shake issue with your GoPro Hero 4 or 5. I hope you enjoyed watching this video. Please leave the comment down in the description below if this video helped you out and fix the issue. If you know the other ways to fix this issue then also please leave the comment down in the description below. That way you can help other people to fix this annoying problem. I hope you enjoy watching this video. Please thumbs up, subscribe to this channel. Thanks for watching. See you next time. Bye bye.